What's going on everyone? My name is Shady and welcome back to Amnesia The Dark Descent. Now my sound is really loud and we're gonna continue on. Let's see what's in this room. Anything interesting? Ooh, no. I hereby offer my full attention and services to Alexander Baron of Brennenberg. This contract will reign for a total Oh, this contract will reign for a total of three years when my freedom shall return to me. In addition, Alexander Baron of Brennenberg is to recommend my services at the Prussian Royal Court and within the sanctum of the Order of the Black Eagle. May no man break this seal. Wilhelm House of Gurch. Oh, tinderbox. There we go. Alright. Let's see. I went over there already. I need to find out what's over here. Oh, God. The study. What was that? I'm lost completely. Okay. I'm hearing all kinds of noise. I don't know if it's a thing or not. 17th of May, 1839. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and the broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it. And as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Ha! Sucks to be you. Wait, I'm Daniel. That light doesn't do sh jack diddly. What was that? Here's someone playing piano. Ooh, oil. Yay, I got more oil. Love it. Is there anything in the stove? Tender box. All right. Wait. Nope. Okay. Smash. Wait. I didn't. I. Oh, never mind. 
I meant to just throw it, not whatever the heck that was. What's this? Local history. It's locked. Momentum. The door, the door leading, the door, the door leading to the local history room is locked. Is there another entrance? Uh, maybe. Anyone here? Oh, well, that's dripping blood. Oil. Just lying right there. Get out of my chair. All right. Is there anything here? Much of the castle is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Alright. <clears throat> East wing? Western wing. Alright. Ooh. Oil Tinderbox Who's playing piano? There's no one playing piano But the I, I opened that, didn't I? I could have swore I opened that. And I could swear that was ch Oh, wait, no. Never mind. Nope. Well, then. I guess I can't go back that way. Hiya! I kind of knew that was there. You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, then. There's some sort of secret door mechanism in the local history room. Alright. Oil. I heard growling too, so uh, yeah, I'm going to get ready to run. Alright. Hacha! Haya! And haya! Oh, that one's already broken. Is there anything here? Nope. Just this note. Altstadt and Brennenberg Castle, 1801. Another rain. Hey, isn't that a. I think that's a, a custom story, Tara. Custom story. Altstadt. 
something like that. Anyways, another region rich with lore is Aldstadt, deep within the East uh, Prussian woods for centuries. There have been stories surrounding the hamlet and its neighbor, Castle Brennenberg. The quiet forest-clad mountains dressed with scattered lakes is as pitch, picturesque, picturesque okay, as can be. Albeit the area is haunted by the dark, ask any local and you will hear proof of the widespread superstition. All travelers should indulge themselves in such conversations since it will certainly serve as exciting entertainment. All of them have their own twist on the tales, but there are some there are some moths, mo motifs, mo motifs, motifs. I never actually learned to. I actually never knew how that was spelled, but. That is the pronunciation of it. Motifs uh, that keep reappearing. The Gatherers. This story reaches all. The, a visit undone. The Immortal Baron. Uh huh. Uh huh. All right. So there's a secret here? Oh. oh. Okay, well that's nothing. So there is a secret here somewhere. Okay, so that's one book. It's two. Three. Oh, okay. Oh. Well, what's in here? Nothing. All right. Well, let's light these things using the tinder boxes. I'm not gonna pick that up. Just I want to see what's in these. Regarding closing of the wine cellar, uh, Wilhelm. And his fools have endangered my research long enough with their absent-minded handling of the human vessels. Human vessels? You mean test subjects, maybe? The sheriff is keeping an, a watchful eye on the forest and is killing my trusty servants. It's just a matter of time until they follow the trail to Brennenburg. I need to look Win Wilhelm. I need to lock Wilhelm and his men up to avoid further investigation from the public. The wine cellar will therefore be sealed off until the matter has been handled. Either the king's men leave or they will starve. Whatever comes first, they can rot for all I care. Maybe I will feed them some wine. It would, it would in a sense solve both of my problems. Oh, it would, in a sense, solve both my problems. Uh. Nothing, nothing, nothing. How many tinder boxes do I have? Oh, I have no tinder boxes left. Bah! I, 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 I knew something was gonna happen. Close it, damn it. Did I hide prematurely? Oh. Well then. Hold on. Before I go in there, I want to find out what's in the other room. Because this door opened over here. 
There might be more oil in here. Or more tinder boxes. I need more tinder boxes. There we go. Wait, what the heck just happened? Did I just get knocked out or something? Seventeenth of May, eighteen thirty-nine. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. Hmm. I don't know what that is. Oh, I'm, am I? Oh, am I doing? Oh, I am doing it. Oh, okay. It was waiting for me, enclosed in dark nothingness. I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. Reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The hmm. next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted, the voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety, and grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. My insanity is really bad right now. I have one tinderbox left. I can't uh, waste it. Study. Uh Wait, what is this? Wine cellar key. Oh, okay. I thought that was <clears throat> key to that. Monster. Is there a closet nearby maybe I can hide in? There's no closet here I can hide in. And that won't budge. Alright, where's the monster? Where is he? Where is that douche? Okay, well, he's not here, apparently. Chair, give me strength. Oh, shit. Chair, protect me. oil do I have left? Ooh, not much. Chair! 
Chair! You're supposed to protect me! Mm-mm. Screw that. The desert dunes were like waves in a sluggish sea, while the cavern... Oh, while the caravan, something. Ow! Well, that kind of hurt. Well, um... You! It won't budge. Uh, because there's a piece of wood over it, I was hoping there would be a memento. Alright, let's go in the wine cellar. Wait, is there, wait, is there red shit all over the place? <clears throat> nope, apparently not. All right, we're going into the wine cellar. Handful of sand tickled from the crumbles of crumbling stone ceiling and pushed down on the brim of his hat. Bra he braced himself. I never read those fast enough to actually, um, to actually finish reading it. They drank all of his wine. How rude. Nothing here. Nothing underneath the stairs either. That's one thing I've learned. Let's check under the stairs. That's my only tinderbox. At least until I find more anyway. Oh, speaking of which. Yay, I found more tinderboxes. Yay. Oh, another one. Uh, anything behind here? Nothing. I feel like this is a bad idea, but I'm going to do it anyways. <clears throat> Nothing. I don't know why there was a barrel in front. Ooh, another tender box. I should be using these tinder boxes, even though they don't light anything. All right, nothing here, nothing else here. I got uh, that. All right. I went in there. Let's go over this way. Nope, I'm going this way. This place seems safe. What's this? Alright, I don't know what that diagram is. But this way seems safe. Ooh. I'll get that here in a bit. Nothing. Tinderbox. All right. Oh, here it is. Oh. You couldn't move if you saw a barrel falling down. 
I mean, tell me, if you saw something about to fall on your head, wouldn't you just step to the side? My insanity is... Get out of here, Barrel. You disappoint me. I was busy looking around and whatnot, and you completely knocked me out, even though I could have moved out of the way and whatnot. I'm kind of I'm kind of freaked out a little bit because I don't know how I'm gonna get out of here actually. All right. Can't combine those. So how am I gonna get out of here? Oh, I have to move this one. Whoops. Hey, 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 ow! You're trying to knock me out again? Oh, man, I completely messed this up. Oh, I left my lantern on. Oops. Alright, so I got that door open. Oh, cool, I got my lantern half full. Alright, so I got the ingredients that I'm looking for. Well, I got one more area I gotta explore. Oh! I did not notice those pigs hanging up there. Nothing. Hello? Who be banging on this door? Yes, I broke your wine. Chest presser? Get out of my way. Y'all not needed in here. I feel like I'm gonna need it more than you. Wilhelm's last words. My name is Win Wilhelm. House of Gurch. Gurich. These are my final words, my confession and testament. Two years ago I summoned to I, <clears throat> I was summoned to the castle Brennenberg as most of the uh, aristocracy I don't think that's how you pronounce it I'm not sure but anyways I was curious about what this supposed knight of the order could want from me and accepted the invitation the Baron was friendly and offered me a, propos a proposition 
it draw it it dawned on me that the nature of the contract was sorted and that the reason I was chosen was because of the follies of my past and not the honors of I've been rewarded with during my time as a soldier. I was to kidnap healthy humans upon his slightest whim and do so without asking questions. In return, he would <clears throat> attest to my character and the royal court, advancing my position within noble societies. I would like to claim that I struggled with my decision, but I, it came swiftly and I accepted wholeheartedly. Ever since that day, I brought men, women, and children to Brennenburg. I can't remember the numbers, but there were many, perhaps even hundreds, none of whom were ever seen or heard from again. Tonight, the, Brennen the Baron invited me to invited me and my men down to the wine cellar to celebrate our work. I had my suspicions as we descended the stairs, but he insisted in and joined us in a toast. The wine tasted fine and my men drank without restraint. So begins the punishment of our sins. The Baron has locked us up and returned upstairs. Forgive me for what I'm Oh, I have done. I was weak and fell into his diabolical ways. My men are screaming. <clears throat> their skin has been pierced by their own tangled bones. I feel my insides re revolt against their god. Uh, God-given nature. Blood has begun to pour from my eyes, and I can no longer... Bleh. Why are you moving? Stop it! Nothing. Alright. Alright, so I got all the ingredients that I'm looking for. <clears throat> The only thing I need, I think I'm missing one, actually. Yeah, I'm missing one ingredient. Anything? Move barrels. Move. I said move. Nothing. That's the last one there. I don't, not gonna like this very much. I already know that. Let's close that, because I got a feeling. Lock up this door with barrels. I have no tinder boxes. I've got a bad feeling because I hear it. I think I heard it already, but I'm not entirely sure. Move, barrel! I'm trying! Trying to move up these stairs as fast as possible. Alright. We're good. 
It became impossible to avoid. The commotion in the streets begged for his attention. He, as he opened the shutters of the French soldiers opened fire on the two young men fighting back, their voices were silenced in the haze of gunshots. All right, well, I'm gonna end it right here. Um, hope you guys enjoy the enjoying these episodes of this old game of Amnesia. Um, yeah, I'm actually enjoying it. I, I really am. Uh, <laughs> I can't believe I didn't play this before. I don't know why, I, but yeah, that that's that's my fault. So, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, please leave likes, comments down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Later.